And okay, hey everybody, I'm Tony, my pronouns are they, them. Hi, and I'm Joe, my pronouns are he, him. Whoa, who's that? Uh, I, I'm the, um, I'm one of the siblings, I'm the, one of the older brothers. The older, you are the, the older brother. The immediate older brother. Because, uh, the, our I'm family. I'm from rural England, of course. We come in pairs. Well, today we're playing Buck Bumble, because we're gonna buck to the bum to the bum to the beat. Uh, arguably one of the best intro tracks of the N64. And so. Fight the, me. <laughs> I mean, oh, we will find out. So the general plot of this game is a poisonous chemical spill that took place many Ooh. years ago has affected the insect population of an abandoned chemical plant. Now, I want to point out something funny here. Okay. In a second here. So only now this disaster is beginning to take its toll. We have all this bullshit going on. The evil herd, because what would you call an insect super race? A herd, obviously. We wouldn't call them a swarm or anything. That'd make no sense. That would make no sense. What were you saying? Oh, I was just saying, like... Where are the humans in this scenario? Do they not see all these little like micro machine <laughs> bugs just like walking around anywhere? Just like, what? What's going on over here? What is this flashing red light? Because we've got like force fields. There's a fence right there. A human made that fence. A human made that fence. That's a cyborg bumblebee. Okay. Yeah. And Anyways, now, so this this music this right. is golden. Golden era in '64. It's absolutely great. Honestly, just look up the 10-hour Buck Bumble sound or uh, go for the 20 hour honestly oh my god is the controller not working it's okay we will restart the controller in a uh, are you uh, it's, uh, you don't restart a controller for that no! before you just plug it in uh, okay one second are we sure all the buttons are in the right spot we're about to find out because I feel like I saw buttons not in the right spot it's fine it's fine it's totally it's, fine no no, I'm not using a rumble pack. All right, <laughs> everything's fine. Yeah, we're we're great. This is um. Oh, okay. So no, I I do want to explain what just happened. The emulators suck. I just went to the emulator controls and it somehow unassigned specifically A, B, and start, but all my other buttons were fine. Oh no, the down on the D-pad was bad too. Oh, you're right. The down on the D-pad was bad. Also, your mission should you choose to accept it. Uh, oh, oh, yeah, it is Mission Impossible, -y, isn't it? Yeah. Well, we're a lone bee going against the world, so yeah. So I, I'm going to throw out there. Some of you might get motion sick just by looking at this. Um, it's. Uh, whew. Nice also, slide. Also, this game well controls animated. infinitely better with an Xbox controller that we have plugged into our N64 oh, God. Than, than the N64 controller yeah, that ever was, ugh. felt. Ugh. Don't forget the points on the bridge. Those are important, I think. Wait. I don't know why. Edge points are just for lives. Um, Joe, you said you said something about secret or, weapons. I do believe. Yeah, you know where the secret weapons are. It, just just yell at me, like shriek at me like a bird. Um, um, I don't think there's. There might be one in this room just because there's like under the bee hut right there. You're about to pass. Oh, there I'm about to pass yeah. over here. It's, it's. I know it's in this section somewhere. There's something. I see. Perhaps and it might just be like a double point bows. I don't know. A double point bows. I don't know. It's been a while, or maybe it's the next. I, it's, I think it might be the, with the teleporter. All there's, right. there's something somewhere. There's, th there's great, a thing. Great, Joe. There's you're a gizmo. You're doing great. There's a gizmo, or it might just be through the teleporter. No, I mean, screw it. No. We'll find it later. All right, fuck it. We're. Not, I, don't, I am losing all. I had such confidence in you the way you were like, oh yeah, I know exactly where the secret weapon well, is. Oh, that's that's health. Remember yeah, that? Yeah. So we're gonna we're gonna eat this nectar because this is how flowers work. Fuck you. Delish. They, Joe, they drip nectar. Hmm. Joe, didn't you say something to me about how we should try not to not cuss as much? I have no idea what you were saying. Yeah. I, I, I never heard that. Oh, the red. All right, so you use the left and the down because the right makes you fox, uh, star fox. That's <laughs> uh, it's not a Cessalon roll, that's for sure. Oh, what are those? Wasps? What are those? Dragonflies. Are they? I think they're dragonflies. They have not enough wings. I, no, I think dragonflies are, um, they're much straighter. Like these... These are not dragonflies. Uh, maybe they're mosquito eaters. I don't know. They're, yeah. they're an insect of kind. Oh, the herd gate opened. Yes, that's the that's the red door from earlier. I don't know why it's called the herd. It's an interesting herbivore to insect. Oh, hornets! Ah, Kill that ah. shit! Oh no! All right, so you have to remain. Mobile. Oh yeah, I love this radar. It's just it doesn't show you directional. It just says, hey, there's someone this far from you like, somewhere. Like, watch out! And I think it goes like green if they're upper below you. Oh, that's a sound. And they make plain noises <laughs> when you shoot them down. Just to, just in case you weren't clear about any metaphors going on here, set in Britain, World War II. <laughs> what, don't worry about it. Rural England. Uh, didn't it say like 18 something, I thought? Maybe not. Oh no, this is chemical spills. It should have been, would have been war time. Um, man, this, this is a good gun. I can feel it. Oh, uh, that is the 
main doohickey. Oh yeah, it's in this room. If you kill all the hornets and the wasp thing, then something spawns, I want to say. And the, um... Oh! Whoa. There's all those, like, little yellow pods on the bottom there. Blow those up, too. Okay. Also, all right. that's a grenade launcher over there on that mushroom. Alright, I'm gonna use the grenade launcher. Uh, cool! <laughs> <laughs> no, no. What, what's your, what's your, what's your buck bump, your baby impression, BB? <laughs> Go! That was good. That was actually really good. Beautiful. Um, so uh, I got that. I think there's a buddy left over. Oh yes, I can use my enemy radar. Oh yeah, and there's one more little dude on the ground. Blow him up, or something. What is that? I don't know what that is. I, I know with them. I, I don't think I see bugs like that in my daily life. Hmm. <laughs> Oh yeah, they explode, so don't be next to them. No, that's bad. That's acid. I just wanted to test if it hurts me. It, it hurts you. It's a rel We're in a relatively safe environment here. I'm gonna go suckle on this. Mmm. Suckle. Ugh. Isn't that an awful word? And don't touch it, but blow it up? Fuck With me you, up. Use a small thing. Don't use the big stuff. Okay. Don't, oh. don't, don't use your face either. <laughs> oh. Oh, oh, I see. It's a mine. Yes. Okay, so... Maybe you don't blow. Maybe just avoid them. Let's just avoid them now. And because it, this is emulating on a proper N64, the N64 controller, even like, look at this. That's a that's some good swing. It's, look at that buck butt. Just move it around. Uh, da, da, time to rump. It's the d diggity buck bumble <laughs> just, <b> butt bowl. <laughs> um, uh, those are floating landmines this time. Yeah, I don't think I need to worry about those. I think they move to you sometimes, or some of them do. Yeah, I'm uncertain. Yeah, sounds good. All right, uh, so we have a buddy over here somewhere. Yeah, it's a, I think it's oh. a hornety guy. Or no, it's another one of the waspy things. It's the big wingy dudes. Oh, is that, is that a big wingy dude right it's there? It's a big wingy dude. I see. Yeah. All right. Uh, I'm not, I'm not sure how I decided to deal with this aspect ratio in post. I probably just zoomed in. So never mind. Ignore whatever I was about to say. Uh, you didn't say it, so I can't ignore it. Oh, well, that's not true though. Joe, you'd be surprised by what you can ignore. It's kind of like chewing, like... Anything's edible if you chew long enough. I highly disagree. No, no. I've heard stories of, of people like see, eating bicycles and shit I like that. I could see chewing rubber. Well, leathers maybe, but not rubbers. Leathers? Yeah, like leather shoes. You can eat leather shoes if you need to. There, was, there was that one bit in that one uh, that one movie. What? Shit. The the comedy guy. Black and white. Um, uh, it's, okay. Okay. No, no, like the comedy guy. I get yeah, the guy. Got it. Done. All right. Know exactly what you're talking about. I have to go destroy three radars. If these are blue, that means I can destroy them. If they're red, you can't. All right. Because there's a shield. Yes. And I keep. Wow, this game's actually holding up pretty well so far. Like, honestly? Yeah. Um, we are. G so this is going to be a three parter, by the way, for those of mm -hmm. keeping track. That's right, you get an hour and a half of my brother. Yeah, that's a lot. Honestly, I don't get an hour and a half of that. Oh, that sounds really sad when you put it that way. I'm just too busy. Oh, I mean, yeah, damn, dude. Okay, well, maybe take some you time. Yeah, All right, that's what I'm up here for. Me time. That is true. Yeah, Joe's visiting Seattle. He mm -hmm. lives in... Uh, Gresham. Gresham. I'm going to tell support. you our addresses. Yeah, like, like home address. I got you. I don't even know my home address, to be quite honest. That's not true. I think there's a one in it. I'm not certain. I think... No, no. That sounds like classic Joe sarcasm. It's like not mean-spirited at all. It's like, oh, you're making a funny. It's good. It's I like good. it. It's good stuff. All right. We have plenty of bazookas. Mm. It's going to be a mint until we get the other type of weapon. I kind of wish I had said it so it's not emulating an actual N64 controller, which you can do in this totally legit n64 yeah no, no you can totally just you know oh. take it apart it's a modular controller it just looks like a 64 controller you know yeah oh also i don't have to kill all the enemies uh i think this might one of the rooms i know if you kill everything it spawns a gun i know there's a room that does that joe i know there is also if you let them hit you they fall down so if you're close to the water they'll get drowned okay so also there's a grenade below you i think or uh, just oh it's more of that Never mind. Do you Couldn't drown? Be. That one drown? No. Not close enough. You have to be real close to the water. But the problem being that if I'm close to the water... You also drown. Yeah, yeah that's, that's the thing. Stuff. I don't need these points. Oh, yeah, there's a walking mode. Look at this shit. Oh, it's... Ah! it's I love, love the landing. The landing's pretty fantastic. It is. <laughs> and the scuttle, the... I'm coming to get you. You're, you're a little old tank. A four-legged tank. Dude, this, this game feels like a particularly mobile tank. 
Like that's yeah, anyways. The, I, the aerodynamics on it don't make sense at all, but are are you are you doing Are you speak oh fuck. Wow. You're, you're getting hammered. It's fine. It worked out. I don't get hammered. I don't drink. Joe I, Joe, you drink. That's you're not wrong. Yes. That's all I have to say on that matter. No, no, stay away from me. Fuck you! <laughs> or sorry. Buck you. And that's what you said. I thought that's what you said. Wait, did I say that? I think you just said that well, and no. then you recredited yourself to say it again. Okay, hold on. People, go backwards in the video. Just go find double out. Double check. I'm pretty sure Tony said buck first. Okay. Well, but did I biggity buck bumble is the question. Uh, absolutely not. That's my favorite part, the biggity, biggity bu buck bumble. <laughs> like the word biggity. Like, like Ooh, it's, it's just weird. Yeah, is there something here? Oh yeah, honey drop in the air. Do? That doesn't make sense, but whatever. Uh, right. Do the floating points make sense? Do the cyborg B herd make sense? No. No, the floating points don't make sense because they are two orders of magnitude less points than the highest point value thing that you can pick up. Uh -huh. So why would you ever pick up the, po the, the little dots? It's just 10 points. Mm -hmm. It's worthless. Seems reasonable. Sorry. Got a little... Oh, there's a time bonus at the bottom. I totally forgot about that. Oh, these guys. These are the... Mm -mm. Yeah, it blows up next to you. They're, oh, they're flat shit. cannons. So Fuck. you need it. <laughs> God! Yeah. <laughs> These are the ones you take out from orbit with the grenade launcher. Wow, yeah, that was bad. Yeah. Okay, let's let's go suckle a little more. Alright. I, I think this is a um, shoot once strafe. And don't Ooh! That got him. Okay. Well I think I also Oh, oh shit. Wait, nope. You just need to keep going. This is a difficult game, isn't it? All right, and they each drop a grenade launcher, I'm pretty sure. Probably. Yep. Yeah, look at that. Cool! And I think the 15 is the max for this gun? No, 20 then. <gasps> Another one! Oh man, this game actually feels pretty good. <laughs> like, so so let's 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 go over the origin of our, our history with mm -hmm. Buck Bumble. Joe and I, I, uh, I made this joke on Twitter. Joe and I, got for for what christmas christmas yeah um buck bumble mm -hmm. and n64 and mario 64 right yes uh we inherited that particular set i do believe oh did we i'm pretty that's sure that, that was from the uh the andersons oh that's funny um i didn't know that uh so we we got those and you know as expected, one of the games we played a lot more than the other. And uh, we, yes, you do. And we we also played Mario 64 a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> that's, that's exactly how it went. Oh. Don't get touched by the critters. They spoot poisons. Like in a good way. Wait, spoot? They spoot it. Mm, I don't like that word, Joe. That's the word I used. I'm going with it. That word's no good. Fuck. Fuck. Just use not that. I have 16 shots. It's I fine. <sighs> it's fine. All right. It's fine. Oh, ah, scatter grenade. This stuff. All right, so if I go here, is it useful? No. Uh, I mean, not in this situation. Yeah. Also, before you go through oh, that. Oh, whoa! Yeah, oh, that's what I was going to say. It's okay, you just need to get, like, right in the center, and yep. apparently they can't you. <laughs> just like, I can't shoot down the middle. All right, should I do it from here? I, I feel like there was an aiming mode for it. Oh. Whoa. whoa. Looked cool. That worked. That's a good weapon. Um, okay, I think I'm good here. I oh. Think, oh, you were right. It does track you. What were you saying? Uh, I think eventually we get, like, there's a weapon that's basically a BFG. Oh, I remember this thing. So, you kill the little guys, and then that dealio opens, and then you can kill the dealio. Oh. Otherwise, they info spawn. Oh, like, wait, did you say kill Dio or the dealio? Uh, Dio works too, see? Kill it now. Ah, and then nowhere the little guys spawn, so you can just kill the little guys at your leisure. I mean, do I even care though? Uh, I mean, if you don't need to. I've decided that I will destroy the satellite. Yeah, you do get a BFG in this game. Oh, God. mission complete. This, this. You straight up Mega Man out of there. You do Mega Man out of there. Um, so this game runs so much better on this totally legit N64. Oh yeah. Oh, oh, this is literally, um, we're going back to save Hoth at this point. This is the first level. See it? Yeah, I mean, they're, like, they made all these nice level, des like, this, all these nice levels. So why not gonna... use it again? I think this one has, like, a time limit or something. Yes, also, turrets. Whoa. This is Hoth. Feels like it. Oh, I didn't come back with all my, um, 
Uh, I think Ammo. even if you just keep scrolling, maybe not. Oh. So do I have to kill them all? Was that the mission? Um, this. Oh, review. No. Uh, okay. So what you had to do is kill the 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 waspy thing. See the blue bar right there? Yeah. That's how far gone the um ooh the uh, base is. And you need to go around the corner here and okay. dodge all this shit. Ooh, ooh, ooh. It's fine. Didn't hit me. I'm good. And then oh shit. There's a thingy somewhere around here. Uh, okay. Oh, yeah, because I have to, like, teleport back because yep. I'm not at the base, which is cool. And now you have to run all the way back to the gate. Ah, there it is. God, th this game ran like shit on the N64. Yeah, it did. It, it is so smooth right now. Like, I feel like the game... Like, do you literally, do yourself a favor. Go buy an X64 and get Buck Bumble and play it. And then watch this and be sad. Oh, okay, that sounds like the opposite of doing yourself a favor. That Going is in hot! Uh, and now you have to kill the waspy things because they blow stuff up. Wait, the waspy things? Well, they, the, you'll see. They, the, the, the floaty ones that don't do anything to you. Ow. Um, Shit. see? Those guys. Oh, I Because they have bombs. Oh, they do have bombs. Because they're the bombers. Oh, mm. because World War II. Okay. Yep. So, any Joe, do you have any other major thoughts about uh, Biggity Buck Bumble? Oh, major thoughts. Um, man. I feel like I need to play through it again. Really? Yeah. Play just. I think it's a it's a good once in a um, blue moon kind of thing. Maybe like once every ten years. Mostly because setting up the N sixty four that's totally legit really sucked. Yeah. Yeah, that does suck. That's the. I mean, you have our N sixty four, right? Uh, I believe the rest of the younger siblings do. Somewhere. Oh, okay. All right, where? Uh, it's, you have to kill everything in this room particularly, sir. Something shooting ass at Uh, it's one of those little crawler guys, I'm pretty sure. I think so. Like, under the other side? Alright, we're going- we're going on the ground. Oh god, but it's destroying <laughs> so quickly. Oh, oh, Wait. maybe it's on the bridge. Oh, you're right. Alright, I hear that in the stereo. There it is. Yeah, like, like, wow, that was- Look at that, we're- we're- so we have headphones on right now, and this stereo is actually useful. Oh, oh, <laughs> ow. Oh no, that's good. It's flashing red. We're not good. This is god. Okay, so I mean, need to search for Oh. Oh. Th oh, this is right. We have to get this. Go back through the teleporter and drop it off on their base. Which actually, I remember feeling really cool at the time. Uh, I mean, it's a pretty cool set. I mean, the whole set piece is in general nice. Yeah, like I don't know. It's got like it's I mean, okay. Yes. Okay, now here's the timer timer. And this is the part where you just buckety book it. Do you say buckety book it? Yeah. Oh, oh, this is a this is the good mechanic where you have to actually land on it. Yeah, there it is. But you also can't if you touch run the into things, it blows up. So don't hit my lines. Like yeah, like I like I hope and, and watch out for these holes. <laughs> watch out was... for these loading gates. Oh, I want that. Oh, but it's okay. Then just go. Okay, and then these tinier holes. That's right. We're the home stretch is right here. Yeah. It's right there. But also, don't run into this. And now you're good. All right, that was pretty actually. Uh, uh, well, well done. Well done, Tony. What's that mean? Diffusion complete. You diffuse the situation by blowing up theirs. <sighs> Doesn't I it mean? D oh, okay, whatever. I have, I have problems with this nomenclature, but whatever. <laughs> All right, they're able to detect their base despite the neutralization of their radar. They use a hidden, heavily protected tower to coordinate their assault. You must destroy four shield generators before you can annihilate the tower. Again, we are a cyborg bumblebee. Yep. Bad ass. It's pretty tight. I mean, I'm for it. Yeah. Oh, you're for it. Like, like yeah, I, you know, I, I support. I can, I, can, I can see bumblebees going cyborg. I mean, to be fair, save the bees. And if we have to make them cyborgs, it's do so. That's just the way it goes. But hold on, that would imply that humans have orchestrated this whole affair. Well, haven't they? They well, so they did the oil spill, but then the, the, to keep the war going, they made Buck Bumble into a cyborg. Wait, so what's Buck Bumble's faction's name? Did anyone say anything about that? I don't. Because uh, I haven't. I don't remember reading that. I. It's probably. Are they? Are, is this just the English version of the herd, and they're mad at the herd? version of the herd okay hold on we should we should be careful to not take a fascism apology approach in buck bumble i feel I, I didn't <laughs> that does go places we probably shouldn't i didn't know that that was a sentence that i could utter <laughs> fuck shit ah, fuck. <laughs> i love the, the impact sound just dink 
Yeah, yeah. because because you're metal. You're made of metal. It's you. You think you're a biggity well, some nice buck bee, bumblebee, but no, you're made of metal. You're a psi ass Borg. Look, Joe said something about not cussing right before we started, and I was like, "Fuck you!" <laughs> no, I didn't, you, I didn't say that. That was not your response. I don't. I don't. I say nice things to people I care about. Wow, I'm I'm really biggity bucking all over the place here. Ah, uh, yeah. Oh, because they're respawning from their biggity buck bumble. Yeah, that's a that's a that's not a good thing. You need to get rid of that. Yeah. It's a hornet nest. I mean, I could also just fuck off. Uh, yeah, but that's not fun. I mean, is it not fun? Okay. All right. You made it. You survived it. There's more to go. Oh. Survived it. Take a little snacky poo. And go dive. God, Diddy this dive. This game's Ooh. making me sick, and I'm playing it. <laughs> Is there a way just to go up? Uh, yes. You hold both buttons. Oh, uh, that's convenient. By both, I mean the A and the B button. Because there were a lot of buttons back in the day. Well, I mean, the N64 is funny because it makes... It looks like there are more buttons than there actually are. But you can only really utilize two-thirds of it at any given time. Yes, exactly. It's not the most well-designed controller. As in, it's a shittily designed <laughs> controller. I, you know, I was going to give it something, but I uh, guess not. Well, because here's oh, the thing. the analog Yes, I got a life. Because the analog stick... Other consoles had that first. It's just that Mario 64 was the first one to implement the control analog stick well. Right? Yeah. Like, other other th consoles had an analog stick. But then they have the D-pad and the C-stick on weird sides, so you can either use the D-pad, the C-stick, or the D-pad, the analog stick, or the analog stick and the uh, C-stick. Uh, 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 which, which sucks, because the D-pad on the N64 is well, it quite even, good. It wasn't even a C-stick, it was C-buttons at the time. Which, you know, I mean, that's, I suppose, a different Switch-esque control scheme. Jesus Christ, this churning. It was yeah. too sharp. I'm not even going to kill these things. I don't see the point. You need to kill the uh, thing oh. you do. Oh, I guess I only have. Please, just let, please. Where's the front? It's, it's only this. There you go. You got it. You got it. Oh, there it is. Well done. That actually was really effective. That's extraordinary. I'm saving those not for enemies anymore. Yep, that's a structure destroyer right there. Oh, boy. I like how that last one right there just, like, flew at you and then stopped, like, an inch from you. Like, ah, never mind, guys. It, it thought better of it. No, uh, that one didn't. Fuck. Ouch. You're gonna... No, it's fine. <laughs> it's fine. Woo! Uh, that was a close one. Will we, will we finish this game in the hour and a half? I mean, that's a great question. We're not even done with the first episode yet. Oh, oh, we get little bloops. Yeah, this is uh, the first boss, I think. Oh, these, no, these are just enemies. And they're, um, look, they, they always, like, lean to one side and then lean to the other side. I'm not even sure what that's for. Well, it might be issues with the whatevers, but, um, they look no, I think this is more or less the first bi big boss, but you're right in that they are regular enemies. Oh, look, we're back at the home base. I do think it's cool that you regularly start at the home base and, like... Okay, so... Oh, the home base switches up what's in it, and that's why I'm like, oh, look, there's a secret in one of these, because eventually there will be. Uh, eh? uh, I'm pretty sure in, like, right before the portal, one of the, the hangar-looking things has yeah. something. I think. Ah, now we're starting to see the big point things. Ah, and there might be something that, like, I always recheck over everything at this point, because you never know. You never know. Okay, go through the wall. I can't go above the wall. No. What? Where are we? Is it? Are these hedges? I mean, where else are you going to hide a cyborg army of insects? I think these are tiny hedges. I guess we're in England. Oh, okay. look at that. We're already over here. So, first, I'm going to scan this horizon. Scan the area. I should have taken that tiny, tiny thing of nectar. All right, so we have our generic gun. This might as well be the generic gun. Yeah, I mean, the, the real generic gun's kind of... Mm. Um, oh, new gun. Mueller? Uh, all right, so I don't, I don't really know what this is. I'm pretty sure this one, that's like shoots needles that explode. Yes, I'm gonna take a... I'm gonna take a, a quick strafe. That, that was a good run. Nice attack run. No. And I think I'm gonna... Oh. Do this by so I'm gonna try to keep moving but also shoot. So I'm gonna hold oh, A and B that was button. Actually, really easy. You should try out this. Yeah, let's see what this is. I don't remember what it does. Okay. Oh, it just shoots really fast. Yeah, they hate it. 
They, yeah, they did not appreciate that one. Right. Um, what? Oh, you have to run now. You have to run back to the teleporter. No, 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 no. This is a boss. I, I, I just can't see. Except uh, on my radar. I think it's below you when it's green. Is it? Uh, oh yeah, this is the boss. Okay. This is ridiculous. I wish I'd known about this thing I'm doing right now. What, what the uh, crap? Yeah, it's having a great time. Uh, of just holding both buttons so you hover upward a little bit, so, and because you're aiming Wait, down... Did, did we ever figure out if the triggers actually, like, strafe you, or they just do nothing? Um, they star fox it. Oh, all right. Okay, wait, what am I doing? No, 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 fuck. Okay, it's fine. I'll get him right. on the next. got it. Whatever. Yeah, biggity buck bumble, there you go. Aha! Oh, 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 oh! Dakota! <laughs> what? You had a sliver. A sliver left. Because I think a game over in this game is a game ass over, right? Uh, yeah, you'd start the whole dealio, like, from the level. And I think you should start checking out our next episode. So thanks for watching, everybody. Hey. If you enjoyed the video, please hit the subscribe button. Yeah. And we also have a Patreon, which you can check out in the end card and in the oh, video wow. description. End cards. Yeah. So thanks for watching. We really appreciate the support, and we'll see you later. Thanks. <laughs> Bump to the boom to the bump to the bass, bump to the